Ahoy mateys. Captain Jack Scrapper here. Uh, it's 11 a.m. Uh, March 24th, 2022. I think I see one. I'm going to try to focus in and then I'll explain. They're very, very tricky. Very elusive. And they can go stealth at any second. I can hear their engines running. Very, very shy, if you will. And there can be some amazing. I see two. And I hear more. Yes, mateys. The little known. Turkey. I'll try to put a little more in the description, but just to explain, it, it, they're very little known and very hardly ever seen. But the Klingon Empire, they modeled their supply ships basically on the same chassis as the Klingon Bird of Prey. Well, the observations I've been making, they're not really a bird of prey. They can stealth, just like the bird of prey. But as far as weapons, the only weapon that they had, because it was just a crew of four on a turkey, a Klingon turkey, it was a supply ship. They kept the Klingon Empire colonized planets uh, going. It kept the outposts going. It was basically food supply and other materials needed to supply the colonies and to trade. But armament, they weren't they weren't armed. The only armament that they that they had was light photons I mean, they were pretty much automatic. Uh, the stealth mode, they could go into stealth and hide. And the only other thing they could do was become a kamikaze and ram. And of course, they'd all die in the process. But And all the Klingons, today is a good day to die. Didn't matter whether they were flying a supply ship or a Klingon bird of prey. We'll talk more about it. Leave your ideas in the comments. Hey, somebody's got to tell the story. Might as well be me. Thank you for coming aboard, mateys. Captain Jack's planet. <laughs> Whether it's this planet or the Klingon planets, who knows? <laughs> Fair winds and smiles, and may God bless.